I'm a bit nervous. Why? I'm gonna fly my drone. It's raining, but I'm gonna only be here probably once in my life. So yeah, let's do it. And we are back to continue where we left off. Part two of our Switzerland adventure. We left our hotel early in the morning to go to one of many attractions in Switzerland. The Rheinfels. From Zurich HB train station, it's roughly 35 minutes travel and transportation in Switzerland is very easy and always on time. By the way, Zurich HB is the largest station in Switzerland. I like it here in Switzerland when it's organized and it's so clean. Even though the instructions or the directions are not translated in English, it's actually pretty straightforward because if you look at your Google Maps, it will actually say the exact name or the exact location in it. I'm not sure if I pronounce it right, it's like Schaffhausen. It's 9 a.m. in the morning, we woke up around 7 o'clock. We are on our way to Rain Falls, and then after that, uh, we'll be going to the Zen. We're here! It started raining, but we're just gonna have a breakfast first and we'll go straight down to Rainfalls. Most of the shops here in House and Rainfall is actually closed on Mondays and Tuesdays. But we'll see, we'll find somewhere to eat. As I've said, most of the shops here are closed on Mondays. That's closed. The previous one is closed. Anyway, let's go back to the other one. I think that we've only seen like two shops that's open. Uh, there's another one, but it's only for takeaway and it's freezing cold outside. Wow, I wasn't expecting that the serving will be this big. I think in Switzerland, it's the other way around. The picture is this small, but the serving is this big. I'm just in awe at the moment. I think this place like you can take a thousand pictures but you can't get enough of it. This is the strongest waterfalls in the whole Europe. And this is the Rhine Falls. I'm a bit nervous. Why? I'm gonna fly my drone. It's raining but I'm gonna only be here probably once in my life. So yeah, let's do it. After being mesmerized by this gorgeous falls, it is now time for us to catch our train going to the beautiful city of Lausanne, known for its beautiful lake surrounded by snow-capped mountains. Travel from Rhine Falls is approximately two hours by train. It's good to purchase the Swiss Pass in advance and we made a mistake. We bought the second class but we are in the first class. Oops, let's go. Let's see, what's the difference between first class and second class? All right, we are now in the second class. <laughs> to be honest, there's not much difference. Very comfortable. Did you call? 
Lord or Hospital Police Security Station with you. Hello, Hello. 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 When traveling around Switzerland, it's best to bring some coins with you because some public toilets require small fee. Oopsie, their toilet has a payment. You have to pay 1.5 CH. Luckily, we got our Swiss pass on sale online. I bought it like um, September. Uh, I got it for 199 euros. And if you buy on the spot for the ticket, from Luzerne to Zurich HB cost 25 euros or 25 CHF. I think we save a lot of money. Welcome to Luzerne! This landscape is something else. It's picture perfect. I want to move here in Switzerland, yeah. like Lausanne or Zurich. We. We, we. <laughs> we think uh, we have a free pass um, to go on a cruise. Boat cruise is definitely a must when visiting Lausanne and it's a very popular stop for most tourists visiting Switzerland. If you don't have the Swiss pass, the ticket for a one hour cruise costs roughly 25 to 30 Swiss francs. The city is well known for its stunning medieval architecture and its stunning location on the edge of the beautiful Lake Luzerne surrounded by snow-capped mountains. The entire lake has a total area of roughly 114 square kilometers and maximum depth of 214 meters. This lake is the fourth largest in the country. This reminds me of Queenstown New Zealand. It's just perfect. Well, I haven't been to Queenstown myself, so I'll be honest. This is the most beautiful landscape that I've seen in my life. It is. It's just, I don't know, too much to take in. Yeah. Mm. We both ended the day with a big smile on our face and can't wait to share more exciting adventures as we explore more of this beautiful country, so keep an eye out for the part 3. We're not ready for this, I think. Woo!